Hey guys, going to be doing some loadout. I got this um, when it was all access. Eight, seven, six, the five, nine, four, and three, the, uh, two, data. one. Fight. The enemy has scored first. The score is now tied. Score posted. You are in the lead. Against the ball. Uh, 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 the enemy has scored, and the match is now tied. The enemy has scored. They are now in the lead. Ooh. The score is now tied. The interesting thing about the game is that basically you, you can make your own weapons. So they give you a lot of parts, and it's really quite interesting. It was good in early access because I just didn't have enough space on the hard drive to play it. That takes a lot to install it. The enemy has scored. You are denied. The score is now tied. It is curious why I would have. The key binding is a little odd, but you can re adjust them as you wish. The enemy has scored, and the match is now tied. And score posted. You are in the lead. There. This one had a boot, so. Oh, yes. That was it. Ooh. Uh, how am I doing? Who's the F stand? Oh, uh, I don't know, but... Oh yeah, it's because it was a pound. Okay. I like this concept early on. And also the damage model on the person is quite interesting because you can get your limbs blown off, which is quite good, and you can still fight for a while. Well, your health is far enough. Yeah, it does think really cool things like that. So cartoons are I wouldn't say this is a TF2 uh, knockoff at all. I really wouldn't. I would more say this is inspired by TF2, yes. But the main game mechanic is making your own weapons, which I think is very interesting. And it's more than that um, Tournament with the strange, with the wacky style and stuff. Generations, eh?
things I pick up at the bottom. Give me speed up to the end of the Oh, this sort of matches a, um... Yeah. Rony bot. Oh wow. Has scored and the match is now tied. Score posted. You are in the lead. Kill confirmed. <laughs> Like there, they've got two currencies. Paid and basically, I think it's quite fair. You play a few matches, you will be able to get. Kill confirmed. Not some other. And the variety of weapons is quite big, and they're still working. Still not yet finished, I don't know. I really think it deserves it completely free to play, so you can go in with it, in with it with no money yeah, down. I went painting with money, and that's why I got a lot of score posted. loot. You are in the interesting lead. things like the FPS counter at the bottom. And you can actually see what FPS I'm recording. I'm recording the same FPS. Look. Quite interesting. I, it's it's if you're sick of modern warfare shooters, things like Call of Duty, and the enemy has Oracle scored, Force, and the match is now tied. I would look at them. Now, I have got to say, I wasn't paying, and I was just like, all, all I really wanted to do was just I forgot this scored. game existed, and then it came back the out on. Steam and I won't get back into it. And the score is now I'm glad tied. I have. I really feel this game has a lot of potential, even though it's still not quite. They just they've got the basic gameplay. And the score is they've got some interesting game mode, like this kill confirm, which is basically the enemy not. has scored. But they are now in the lead. I'll show you the interesting thing about You have lost. Ooh, lost this map. But... Brony bar. <laughs> We're only 7 kills, but a uh, score of... Not bad. 7 to 10 deaths. That's not a bad ratio for me. In most... Well, in any shooter, let alone... The only thing I'd say is... Daily prize. Wow! I forgot about this, you get daily prizes. And... There's a lot of things you can do. So... Let's... Cancel. Weapon crafting, let's show you... Let's show you what this game really is good at. I'm not too happy with my girl tower, so let's customize this girl tower. Um, you can go for things like Tri Barrel, which sort of gives you smaller rockets. 
but it gives you more than an easy to do. This is because of its carriage. The carriage is the basic of the larger rocket that takes longer though. We can have two. We need to wait about oh, one. Blast radius. I'm going to go for that. And you can also go down to it. It's like you can have a Tesla round, you can have a healing round, you can have a. Once you unlock it, you can have a pyro round, you can have a reducer, whatever. I remember that from something, but the lover travels in an arc. You could. an angular slowly on Give me a second. Sorry about that. Things like the corkscrew that basically spirals rocket propulsion sends to the corkscrew. That would be more useful if you were going to go for something like the tri barrel. And you can go for recon scope, laser guidance, bio scanner. Or you can go for you can go for two round bursts, three round bursts, <laughs> spooling three round bursts. Oh, hold that, hold that, try and load multiple projectiles. Well, and ooh, ooh, right. And you've also got the stock, which is ridiculous. And this is only for the rocket launcher. You've got the rifle, which is iron sight, you can go <laughs> up to the room. Long range dead X-ray, sniper scatter, spooling to rank. And you've also got you've got pyro for this, which basically means oh, I haven't ever tried that. You've got things like oh. and you've got scatter sniper, and it just keeps going. And this is only level one, rank one. There are lots of ranks, and you've got things like the tape treatment. Yeah. Mm, yeah. You've got a tech tree over here, and it just keeps going. Wide scatter. And these cost blue, which are these things down here. And these are given to you for free. These are for um, outfits for your people. The people you want to like customize. You can customize like everything. But these cost a little bit of money and they're not that bad. They're not that bad. Um, I'm really going to say this, this game is fair because most of the time you can uh, It doesn't really ram the paywall into your face as much as some games do. Um, I don't know, I don't like that Tesla. Okay, customize. So let's go for a beam. Go for Tesla. That will cost me two thousand blues. So that's basically all my blues for what I've done for the last match. So or I can go for and things like that. But if it you never see the other can buy extra blue to cash, but most of the time you just need to pay a bit more <laughs> to really get to that level. Which is very kind. So you've got heat sinks and stuff. Being the unlimited ammunition pulse. You can go to bouncing. Ooh, bouncing Tesla. Mm. Mm, that's a slug. Yeah. And you 
you also test it before you want to try it. So, here we go. Let's you test it. If the models are actually loaded in or something. For some reason, the models seem very handy to load in. And that's slow. So, got really interesting because that bouncing. quite easily so you go so you go back to the weapons of here and go right well I want a scatter for that it'll let you test it and so that will give you a shotgun and you can have a bouncing shotgun if you ever ever supposed to do a modern warfare one if they put this kind of mechanic in it, oh my god, they'll make millions. Ugh. Cause you sort of okay, well I don't want that. I want talk through then. Let's try that. Talk through doesn't really work for that very well, so and you sort of test it sort of makes my job doing like study this pretty much useless <laughs> and I'm not that disappointed by it. Oh wow. I think that's more for... You sort of get a laser sight. Right, well, I don't want that. I want a launcher. Tribal. Uh, corkscrew. Bouncing. Yeah, here we go. You can manually control your rocket. And you can have, like, you can have, like, clusters. And you can get the Tesla. You can, you, um, you can test this stuff. So, right. Okay, right, you go. Oh, yeah. And you the space things. You don't you only need to really Oh wait. Oh the manual trigger. Wait, okay, you can manually trigger the detonation. I thought it was something else, but hang on, there's something else you can try. I think it's with the cage. Uh, I've tried it. Where is it? Slug you gotta do it with. No, that's detonator. Shall impact sticky. There is there was something interesting that I've seen somewhere. Where is it going? Perhaps that was it. Perhaps it was the laser guidance on this. Yes, I think it was, because look. This is going to take a while, because... Yeah, it was laser guidance. Um, I, I have played with a... This one and this, that I remember playing with. And 
fucking useful. It's really clever. You can also melee. There's nothing really advantageous about doing melee in this game. You're pretty much going to stick to a small range weapon. That sometimes can happen, but this sort of gives you a... Ooh. But, you see what I mean? Uh, it, no. I mean, you can go for high capacity, shell laying, I wouldn't really recommend it with anything but a scatter. Uh, spooling, I'll show you the spooling, which is quite nice. Um, I haven't got enough. Bioscanner is interesting. Let me show you. Right. It shows you how much health they have. So, if you're in a barrel, you wouldn't know that this was a. This was an easy kill. And this was an easy kill. And you, you'd probably go for something like this. Guy. But you can also see the. You can also see the damage from long range. Quite interesting. So, say I chuck a grenade. And you can sort of see a... You can't really see medium damage, but you can see... Oh, you need to reload. But... You'll see what I'm going getting out of here. You should try this out. I really recommend that you do. So please go out and see what this game is about. On Steam, completely free. Uh, it's not a large download. It's about uh, two gigs if I remember correctly, maybe four. But give it a go. I recommend it. I bought in early. Didn't really play it because my computer was being buggy, but it's a good game. The map design's good and I'll give it a go, guys. So thanks for watching. I recommend this wholeheartedly. Loadout on Steam right now.